Yesterday, I listened to a speech by the Home Secretary to the Police Federation of England and Wales. It went down well, there's no denying that. She reaffirmed the support of her government for the police and thank goodness for that. The centrepiece of her speech, however, was the Tory pledge to put another 20,000 police on the streets. I couldn't help feeling, though, that the reason we need to have this massive recruitment of police is because that same government has actually reduced numbers by that over the last 10 years. Those years of austerity have hit policing hard. We've had to turn away tens of thousands of excellent people because we simply couldn't afford to pay them. Those people now would be senior constables, really experienced detectives, people who knew their community after years of experience and junior sergeants. They're not there, they never will be, and we're gonna to have to pay the penalty of that lack of recruiting for many years to come. We'll survive, we'll recover, we'll serve the public well, because that's what British police do, but don't underestimate the difficulties uh, that we've got ourselves into uh, to do that. However, let's not be churlish. 20,000 extra police officers is better than zero, and uh, all forces, including Surrey, are having a really strong recruiting drive to get the very best quality. So I'll leave you with a message to anybody listening to or watching this who wants to join the police. Come on in, the water's fine, we will welcome you. You've got a great career ahead of you, and so I hope you can sign up to join British Policing.